Now at 4 starts right now. I'm Faye Fredericks. We are tracking breaking news right now. A lockdown at Apache Junction High School just lifted Air 15 over the scene this afternoon. The school is near Southern and Ironwood Drive. Parents being told to go to a nearby CVS. That's where we find ABC 15's Nicole Valdez. Nicole, what started all this? Well, first off, I want to let you know that we were standing outside the school with parents as they were literally shaking in fear for what was going on inside, waiting for their kids news of what was going on there. It was so quiet, though, you could actually probably hear a pin drop out here. Now, police tell us there is no emergency situation here, but they did get a call from a teen saying he heard shots fired. It was probably about a dozen or so officers outside the school here on standby with their guns at their hips ready to go as others went inside looking from room to room for that possible gunman. Now, students were told were huddled in corners inside of their classrooms. One family on the phone with their sophomore student. Her, she was whispering to her parents after her teachers told everyone to be quiet, lay low, and wait for police to get them. They're just being quiet, and you could hear her on the phone, but they're just trying to be quiet as possible because she's scared and I was trying to calm her down while I was driving from Mesa Drive here because she was scared and crying and everything. Now, police say that teen who called 911 could face some serious, even felony charges here. But thankfully, many of those students now back with their families. I'm going to send it over to John Genovese, who got to speak to some of those parents after being reunited with their students. John. the students inside okay. the school and the parents waiting outside. Hundreds of them swarming the perimeter all around campus. A city official tells me because this happened so late in the day, there wasn't really one spot to direct them to. They just started gathering here. Some of them waiting near officers anxiously awaiting some sort of update. We did speak with one mother racing here from work and finding out thankfully her daughter was OK. Uh, young adults are even adults they're heartless they don't take into consideration that what they're doing as a prank or not could really hurt somebody and it just so happens that it's hurting me because i had more faith in the kids at this school Now, once that lockdown was lifted, the school did clear out pretty quickly. Now, one of those Apache Junction police captains tells me there were around 20 students in the room with that caller who we understand is now detained. Those 20 students are now being interviewed one by one to determine their involvement. But for now, reporting live, John Genovese, ABC 15, Arizona. Such a scare. Thank you. As this story continues to develop, count on ABC 15 to bring you the very latest on air, online, and of course on our free ABC 15 mobile app.